Good day. Hi, I'm Jess. I'm about to discuss to you SQL Server Reporting Services. Okay, so for us to start uh, SQL Server Reporting Service, so we'll just create a new project under um, Visual Studio 2019. Click this one. And, the, and then um, look for reports. Here. So we're going to click this one, this one. I'll double click this one and then I'll name this one as um, iMerge Demo SSRS. Okay. Press create. Now, this is the um, Visual Studio. Right now, um, we'll be creating our um, report. So, but first, we're going to create first the data source. We're in the ref, we're going to define there the configuration of the reference of the uh, database, the location of the database, the location of the data, the data set. This would be the um, uh, this would be the the set the result set that we'll need to produce the report and then last but not the least the report uh, itself okay so let's get started so here i'll be going to solution explorer here and then i'll click this folder here which is shared data source i right click this one and then click add and then new item so with the new item i i'll click this option here, which is the data source, click add. Okay, so with this one, I'll name this one as let's say data uh, data uh, source um, demo. Okay, so and then I'll click the type here, wherein I will choose the Microsoft SQL Server. Click OK, and then click Build here for us to uh, build the connection string. So with this one, I'll just click a dot, wherein I will connect to our local host. And then after clicking the dot here, we go directly on the select on or enter a database name. We just click by default the Windows authentication to over. Um, uh, I mean to say, if, if you want to pass the um, username and password uh, text box. So I'll be clicking this one. And then let's say I'll be choosing, um, let's say, DB Merge Solutions. Okay, test connection. Okay, so it, the connection is successful. So after the two, this one, I'll just click OK. So with this one, I'll click the credentials. So by default, I'll be choosing the Windows authentication here. Click OK. There. So with this one, I'll be visiting it again for me to see. So it's using the Windows authentication. Right now, we're done with the um, uh, data source. Now we're gonna go to SQL Server. So with the SQL Server, okay, I'll connect using database engine click OK wait for it and then um, look at look at this one so I have here the DB merge solutions here there so I'll be using this uh, specific table let's say I would like to select all the columns under customer okay so this is what I'll gonna do okay so oops so what I'm gonna do is Let's say I'm going to click new query here and then I'll select I'll select that specific table which is customer. I'll drag this one here and then this specific on what database. So this is DB Merge Solutions with S. Click this one. Then uh, we're going to uh, test this one by pressing uh, execute or F5 
there so it's working so i'm gonna copy this one i'll be using this script onto this um report okay so right click for us to create a data set we just right click that folder and then click new item and then this data set i'll click add and then here i'll be defining this one as um demo demo image okay So now I'll be using the that query that I created a while ago. This one. So I'll just click OK. There. So it's successfully been created. So I have a data source and data set. And then I'll be creating the last stage of this um, tutorial, which is the report. I just right click the reports, click, click um, add new item, and then this report. Okay, and name this one uh, our report uh, underscore demo one. Okay, so click add there. So it is successfully been added here. So you can see here. So this is the report. And then um, right now, I will add a table. Okay, so how will I add that table? Okay. So here, I'll be clicking the toolbox here and then drag this table here. So this table will be the, our, our next step. So the moment you drag the table, you will be asked what data set you'll use on this report. You just click this data set demo iMerge, which we created a while ago. Click OK there. So with this one, I'll add some specific columns let's say i would like to add customer name and then customer country and then customer amount so let's say we would like to preview the table there okay so we wait for it so he, here you are so it's been created successfully okay this is our um, um all this uh, preview uh, report so let's say we would like to save this one as Excel we like we just right click this one and then click Excel okay so and I will name this one uh, Excel and then demo one then click Save okay so I'll be viewing it now so that you can see okay so this is the report so I'll double this is the report that I'm telling you. Okay. I'll double click. So it's been properly transferred to Excel. See? Okay. There. So it's good. So what if we would like to, um, um, we would like to save this one as, let's say, PDF. I always cl just click PDF. Okay. So save. There you are. So we've been created. So let's say we would like to 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 open this one for sure. To be sure on our um, process. Okay. So this is the report. So there. So what if we would like to um, just click this one or just delete this one? Let's say I, we would like to define the colors on this design. I just click this one. Let's say we're gonna we're gonna change the color here. Let's say the, the background color. Okay, so let's say you just click this one to um, sky blue. Click OK. So there. So we're gonna preview it. See? So there's already color. So let's say um we would like to um we would like to change the um the font. We're gonna make it bold there see so I'm gonna preview it again okay so more of this um uh things okay so this is introduction to 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 ssrs uh uh presented by iMerge solution so we we um we accept um uh trainings okay so we offer training for 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 individuals that who wants to to change course 
specifically for for IT. We do programming. We do SQL. We do Java. We do .NET. We do as well PHP, even Python. So we invite you to to train with us, and then um, um, I will make sure that you're gonna learn from scratch until to advanced level. Okay. So thank you. This is Jess of iMerge Solution. Thank you and um, good day.